What's going on everybody? Scott Evans, Vice President with Hunters for Life here to bring you our weekly update. We're currently down here at the Dead River, right by Lake Superior. It's about 60 yards that way. We're in search of a monster pike. We've uh, been down here the last two days, seen him jump a couple of times and uh, just sadly haven't been able to connect with him. But on another note, our first update we got for you guys, I don't know if you got a chance to check out our video. We were uh, blessed to go down over, over my birthday actually last weekend to take part in the event Bows for the Brave, put on by Michigan Operation Freedom Outdoors. We had 29 veterans down there and 14 captains that donated their time and their boat to take them out. Everybody was able to shoot a fish. Sadly, uh, sadly our team didn't win, but we had a great time. Got to spend some time with a couple of Marines. The next update we got for you guys is uh, if you're from Michigan, especially the you know lower area of Michigan, you got to go over to Wolverine Lake and check out our buddy Kevin Rentner. He's got a shop or tackle shop out there. This guy. Uh, He's one heck of a bow fisherman, that's for sure, but he wanted to, you know, do everything he could to help us out. So he came up with a great idea to raffle off a bow fishing trip for, you know, anybody that was interested. He's been selling tickets for $10 a piece. The guys raised like $500 already now in like a week. So that definitely exceeds all the money that we need for our standard rock trip. So with that being said, it's about time for us to start planning another trip. Last update we got for you guys is, uh, First off, I want to give a shout out to you, Tori, out in Colorado for uh, just being an incredible human being and offering up your couch to us this this winter, or this, this winter to go out and uh, do a little bit of waterfall hunting out there. Last year, he uh, he killed a thousand ducks and 400 geese. So we're gonna be more than more than humble to get out there. Hopefully, we'll be able to find a kid or find a veteran out in the area that'll want to come out with us. We only killed seven birds last year, so it's going to be well, well worth the drive. With that, as always, guys, Scott Evans here. Happy adventures.